today i am going to show how to install open project to send to a 7 environment and database is mysql and web server is apache 2 so here i wrote some step now i am going to step number 1 here i just write sudo su for root access just here so here i access the root access now i am going to number 2 for name server configuration just i am paste it and enter sorry here already name server configured into my server if not configured then i have to add this this one or any other what you like just i am going to point this now i am going to the step number 3 yam update stick time now it's 24 percent now 71 percent downboard now <coughs> i'm going to press just y yes Is this okay? Just I press yes. Okay. Now it's installing. now em update has been finished i already finished step 3 now i am going to the install w8 just i paste and click enter just write here y yes already step 4 has been finished now i am going to repository going to install repository just i am copy this one is already given my youtube description box just paste this one and enter installation has been done just again i am writing the yam update just paste press y update already has been finished just i am going to step number 7 install the open project this take some time because it is one 34 megabyte now installing package okay open project has been installed now i am going to step number 8 open project configuration just i copy this one just paste and go to click here you see 
already I given step here host name and server prefix do you want to enable SS okay so before host name just I am going to here you see two package one is the mysql one is the mysql just I select the mysql and second is the apache server just I am going to click okay then just I am number one host name what you want just I remain this one just click ok and prefix I have nothing to put here just ok and do you want to enable SSL security socket layer just I am going to just no ok and here you see install subversion repository support ok just I am click the installation option then ok then ok again install git repository just select then ok again ok again ok then send mail or smtb i am just skip this one just go and install new memcache server just i am click ok you see all of step already done ok just it's take time to configure wait a little bit just complete it just wait to finish it's almost going to finish Now step, no, step number 8 has been finished. Now I am going to step number 9. Here you see port HTTP 80 MySQL and SSS have to be opened. So, so here two options. One is you will open from firewall and another you will from if you have EC2 or cloud then you will open from cloud instance. So just I am going to just cloud console here you see this is my PC so now I am going to the security group just select this one inbound role I am at some role here add role as for example HTTP just select and another role mysql because it needs mysql okay just i am going to the save role just save button it's already saved okay 
you see port 80 is open 22 open and uh, mysql port 3306 is open okay now port number uh, step number 9 has been finished or uh, if you want to configure firewall from instance then you will carry on by this command now i am going to the check go to the step number uh, 10 then check port listening just i am copy this one just paste into here you see mysql port at the already listening http http port already listening okay so, so now i am going to okay here just i got all. open U, url or ip to so, show it will be 12 and it will be 13 to so, open url what is my url or ip just i am going to see my ip is this one just I copy into my browser. Sorry, maybe one one three. You see, open project already open. So, so step number 11 already finished now i am going to login open project user admin password already admin just i sign in admin password admin just sorry just sign in you see okay i have to change my password so, so current password admin and given password just go to the save then it's okay step number 12 has been finished now i am going to all you all of you know i already install mysql database but till now i didn't get any password to mysql so how we will know the mysql password and all of you know user wrote but password we don't know so how we will get just i copy this one you see root password this is the root password so, so you just copy this copy this one just paste it here this is the root password so thank you for watching my video if you have any question please let me know i will back as soon as possible thank you